friends, welcome back to our channel. So, throughout spring and summer, our plants have been growing a lot. As a result, my plants have been so bushy. So this is my pink bubbles. Other two bubbles here. So, I feel like it's about time that I should trim them and then do propagation. So today, we'll just be talking about pink bubbles and how to care for them and how to propagate them. So like most plants, pink bubbles require well-drained soil. They require um, adequate light. They require a lot of light, but indirect light. They require fertilizer, let's say once a month, and then watering once a week, just enough to give moisture. One important thing is that to, remain, to maintain this pink variegation, this pink and creamy variegation aside from enough light they should be trimmed once in a while because I've been busy so let's do the trimming now and then later the propagation it is easy as one two three so what we need of course we need our pink bubbles something to cut and then I've actually prepared the soil where we'll plant our cuttings and then spray bottle. Okay. Let's continue cutting. So here. trimming and I have this lot to plant and then here's the mother plant another mother plant I think I've overdone this but they were not any more healthy they were thin and quite long so and then this one as well so we're done with that one next is the propagation let's proceed so it will just be easy so i've got this two small pieces and then make a hole Feel the whole thing.
pots, newly planted pots. So this one, normally it should not be like this, but because I have a lot of cuttings and I just want them to grow faster. So the I've just planted directly the longer ones. But you can also do start with short ones. So bring this in the greenhouse and then I'll show you guys those pink bubbles that I have propagated a few months ago. So still have a lot of cuttings and I'll propagate them later when I will have the time but anyways I hope this video will convince you to plant pink bubbles aside from it's pink it has beautiful color it grows so easily and then it's not a fussy plant and then of course you can propagate them easily to give to your friends or probably sell so hope you learned something see you in the next video bye